Richard Neal Zare, born November 19, 1939 in Cleveland, Ohio, is the Marguerite Blake Wilbur Professor in Natural Science and a professor of chemistry at Stanford University. Throughout his career, Zare has made a considerable impact in physical chemistry and analytical chemistry, particularly through the development of laser-induced fluorescence (LEAF) and the study of chemical reactions at the molecular and nanoscale level. LEAF is an extremely sensitive technique with applications ranging from analytical chemistry and molecular biology to astrophysics. One of its applications was the sequencing of the human genome. Zare is known for his enthusiasm for science and his exploration of new areas of research. He has mentored over 150 PhD students and postdoctoral researchers, of whom more than 49 are women or members of minorities. Zare is a strong advocate for women in science, and a fellow of the Association for Women in Science AWIS as of 2008. Education Zare earned his BA in Chemistry and Physics in 1961 and his PhD in 1964 in Physical and Analytical Chemistry at Harvard University. As an undergraduate he worked with William Klemperer. Zare moved to the University of California, Berkeley to do Ph.D. work with Dudley Hirschbach, then returned two years later when Hirschbach accepted a position at Harvard. Zare completed his Ph.D. thesis, a theoretical analysis of molecular fluorescence and photodissociation, with Hirschbach at Harvard in 1964. Topic. Career Zare joined Massachusetts Institute of Technology as an assistant professor in 1965. From 1966 to 1969, he was jointly appointed in the departments of chemistry, physics and astrophysics at JILA at the University of Colorado Boulder. In 1969 he became a full professor in the Department of Chemistry at Columbia University. He was named the Higgins Professor of Natural Science at Columbia in 1975. In 1977, Zare accepted a position as a full professor of chemistry at Stanford University, becoming the Marguerite Blake Wilbur Professor in Natural Science in 1987. He served as chair of the chemistry department from 2005 to 2011. Zare served on the National Science Board (NSB) of the National Science Foundation (NSF) from 1990 to 1996 and was the board's chair from 1994 to 1996. He is a member of the editorial advisory boards of several scientific publications, among them Chemistry World, Angawant Chemi, Central European Journal of Chemistry, Journal of Separation Sciences and the Chinese Journal of Chromatography. He is chairman of the Board of Directors at Annual Reviews, Inc., and serves on the Board of Directors of the Camille and Henry Dreyfus Foundation. Research Zare is well known for his research in laser chemistry, particularly the development of laser-induced fluorescence, which he has used to study reaction dynamics and analytical detection methods. His research on the spectroscopy of chemical compounds suggested a new mechanism for energy transference in inelastic collisions. He and his students have developed tools and techniques to examine chemical reactions at the molecular and nanoscale levels. They have explored a wide-ranging variety of problems in physical chemistry and chemical analysis including examination of heterogeneous structures in mineral samples, the contents of cells and subcellular compartments, and the chemical analysis of liquid samples. Early in his career, the question of whether laser-induced fluorescence leaf could be used to study aflatoxins spurred Zare to adapt leaf for use on liquids. Work with postdoc Gerald Diebold resulted in the first use of leaf for detection in chemical analysis. This opened up the potential for a wide variety of fluid applications, including the detection of single molecules in liquids at room temperature and detection methods for capillary electrophoresis. Zare and his co-workers have combined CCD imaging with leaf detection to detect amyl and zeptamoly amounts of FITC labeled amino acids. Zare and his students have also developed cavity ring down spectroscopy CRDS for quantitative diagnosis, and for high performance liquid chromatography. HPLC. Zare is also involved in the development of desorption electrospray ionization techniques, which are being used for mass spectrometric imaging of lipids, metabolites, and proteins in tissue samples, including prostate cancer. 
I'm right now very excited about mass spectrometry, still excited about lasers, all types of analytical techniques, but to me, they're tools. They're not ends in themselves. With new tools and measurement techniques, you can make advances in all types of fundamental problems. Richard Zare Zare has also worked with NASA and others on astrobiology. He is one of the co-authors of a paper that appeared in Science in 1996, raising the possibility that a meteorite from Mars, ALH84001, contained traces of Martian life. Zare used two-step laser mass spectrometry L2MS, a technique that is particularly sensitive to organic molecules, to examine samples from the interior of the meteorite. He found that the 4.5 billion year old Martian meteorite, discovered in Antarctica, contained polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons. This led researchers to speculate on the presence of fossilized remains from Mars. Other researchers questioned this interpretation, suggesting that the sample might have been contaminated after its arrival on Earth. Considerable controversy resulted, which Zare felt disrupted his ongoing laboratory research. Zare has also worked with NASA on examinations of organic materials obtained from Comet 81P, Wild by the Stardust spacecraft. Topic publications Zare has published several books, including a widely used textbook on the topic of angular momentum in quantum systems that is considered a classic for its explanations of angular momentum algebra and the fundamentals of molecular spectroscopy. He is an author or co-author of nearly 1,000 peer-reviewed papers. Topic selected publications Zare, R. N., Fernandez, F. M., Kimmel, Jr. The 3rd of January 2003. Hadamard Transform Time of Flight Mass Spectrometry, More Signal, More of the Time. Angawant Chemi International Edition in English. 42 1, 30-5. doi, 10.1002, PMID 19757587. Wu, H., Wee, Wheeler, A., Zare, R. N. The 24th of August 2004. Chemical cytometry on a picoliter scale integrated microfluidic chip (PDF). Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences, 101, 35, 12809-12813. Bibcode, 2004PNAS, 1011-2809-W. doi, 10.1073, PNAS.0405299101. PMC 516477. Zare, R. N. The 20th of March 1998. Laser Control of Chemical Reactions, PDF. Science. 279 5358 1875 to 1879 Bibcode 1998 Psi, 279 1875 z DOI 10.1126 science.279.5358.1875 Alexander AJ Zare RN 1998 Anatomy of elementary chemical reactions PDF Journal of Chemical Education 75 9 1105 to 1118 Bibcode 1998 jched ched 0.75 1105a DOI 10.1021 ed 075p 1105 Althorpe Stuart C Fernandez Alonso Felix Bean Brian D Ayers James D Pomerantz Andrew E Zare Richard N Reed Eckert the 7th of March 2002 Observation and Interpretation of a Time-Delayed Mechanism in the Hydrogen Exchange Reaction. Nature. 416 6876, 67-70. Bibcode, 2002 Natur.416, 67A. doi, 10.1038, 416067A. PMID 11882892. Topic books Shu, Donald K., Monts, David L., Zare, Richard N. 1978. Spectral Atlas of Nitrogen Dioxide, 5530-6480A, New York, Academic Press. ISBN 0-12-357950-3. Zare, Richard N. 1988. Angular Momentum, Understanding Spatial Aspects in Chemistry and Physics. New York, Wiley. ISBN 0-471-85892-7
Zare, Richard N., Spencer, Bertrand H., Springer, Dwight S., Jacobson, Matthew P. Laser Experiments for Beginners. Sausalito, California, University Science Books. ISBN 0-935702-36-9. Zare, Richard N. Angular Momentum, Understanding Spatial Aspects in Chemistry and Physics. New York, Wiley. ISBN 0-471-24478-3. Kleiman, Valeria, Park, Honkin, Gordon, Robert J., Zare, Richard N. Companion to Angular Momentum. New York, Wiley. ISBN 978-0-471-19249-7. Young, Edward S., Zare, Richard N. Annual Review of Analytical Chemistry, Volume 1. Annual Reviews Inc., U.S. ISBN 9780824344300. Young, Edward S., Zare, Richard N. 1998. Topic. References Topic. External links Media related to Richard Zare at Wikimedia Commons